Oh, uh, from the context, we think it means kill me now. <laughs> Jim Parsons, everybody. This is my this is my first time with uh, Jeff being oh, you, live. You've never met Jeff before. Well, I, we sort of I feel like we sort of had a meeting before, but then I don't know. It was weird. And the last time I was here, he was on a red carpet. Oh, that's right. He was on the red carpet. Yes. Event. Yeah, he was out yeah. on assignment. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> He gets around. How are, well, well, you weren't on the red because you do all the red carpets, though, don't you? Yeah, yeah. So, uh, well, no, I don't do all the red carpets. If I have to go to something and do a red carpet, I'll do a red carpet. What, like, for example, designer vodka? No. <laughs> No, I'm not big into the product red carpets, no. Oh, no, they're great. There's it's a... an occupational hazard, so there. Oh. You do, you've done a red carpet. No. 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 I'm sure you have. True. You've had movie premieres, Craig. Yeah, but... Not big enough to have them in the no, red carpet. No, no. A small purple roll. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, happy Groundhog Day, by the way. And to you, do you as well. Do you what? celebrate No, Groundhog I don't Day? celebrate it. No, in fact, I only think of the movie when I hear that word. So I, do I, actually. Growing up in Texas, we didn't have the kind of... So six more weeks of winter it probably meant it was going to be 90 for us. It yeah. Matter. Well, you're from southern Texas. I'm from southern yeah. Houston, yeah. yeah. So uh, this was in Do you have uh, uh, groundhogs or beavers down there? Oh, I think we have beavers. <laughs> wink, wink. <laughs> That's what I wanted from Jeff. Yeah, yeah. No, he's very much into the innuendo. Oh, of course he is. Hey, he now, is. Uh, listen, congratulations on the show. It seems to be doing very well. The things are going lovely. Yeah, you can get you. yourself on a decent network if you're yeah. not careful. Yeah. Well, if you're careful, you can keep on one. <laughs> that was not... <laughs> that was such an unintentional dig. No. I don't think it was unintentional. No, I think it was really a dig. Was. Well, subconsciously it might have been very intentional, but I never for a minute would have ever hurt you. Are you a b oh, thank you. No problem. Oh, that was a tender moment. <laughs> it was. It was an unexpected tender I moment. I think it's inspired by Jeff. <laughs> Not if it was a tender moment. No, I don't think it was inspired by Jeff. <laughs> oh, my. Yeah. yeah. Oh, my. I love that. No, it's very nice. So, uh, how do you uh, celebrate Groundhog Day? You don't, then? Uh, well, do I don't really. I mean, I do more now that, that I realize you're so into it. Now, do you... <laughs> is that something that you find funny about America, that we have Groundhog Day? No, no, bless you. It's not you. a worldwide no. phenomenon, is it? Like, it's not even an America-wide phenomenon, well. let's be honest. You know, I think a you're couple right, of people go right. to Groundhog Day. I, I think of the movie. I think of the Bill Murray yeah. movie, you know, yeah. and the living the same day over and over and over again, like right. some kind of talk show watch. Right. No. <laughs> I, but that, I, well, I was thinking the movie didn't have much, like, it was about living the same day over and over again, but the groundhog coming in and out of the ground, that don't, that's not really about doing the same thing over and over again, is it? No, but I think it's about six more weeks of winter. Okay, so just you know, I think the, the allegory same, was you're okay. going to stay in the right. winter, you're not getting out of the dark. Yeah. Didn't you watch the Doctor Who Christmas special, man? <laughs> you didn't! No, I'm sorry. You are nothing no. like your character <laughs> on the Big Bang Theory! <laughs> No, it's okay. I've heard wonderful things, though. Oh, no, it's... it's you don't watch? I, I think that... I don't know why. Well, I mean, you enjoy Doctor Who a I lot. Love Doctor I know Who, you yes, do. I, I know do, you I do. really... But I grew up where, you know, Doctor Who lives. Gallifrey. Right. Really? No, I... Oh, oh. Earth, you know. See, I don't even know that's... Is that a fake place he lives? Well, Doctor Who? He's Gallifrey? From, he's from, he's from Gallifrey. Yeah. That's not real. No, neither is Doctor Who. Well, I mean, realize... <laughs> No, he's a, he's a fictional character. Oh, I hate coming here sometimes. No, come on. No, come on. How, how's uh, Kaylee's leg, by the way? She all right? W wonderful. Yeah? She, she really is, uh, is. She's hopping. Is that what you said? Yes. Is yeah, she, she was hopping actually. Um, but uh, hopping on the bad leg. She'll hop on both legs. <laughs> when, when this is the thing. I have heard a, that. You know, not that it's my story to tell, Kay Kaylee. I'm sorry, but uh, she was a really big, you know, as you know, I big know, break. It was a huge deal. She is. Uh, kudos to the doctors, obviously, but kudos to her as well. She is the most resilient, bounce back. Um, you know, I mean that quite seriously. I, she is. Uh, she's just a physical. Person? I don't have a word to say. Yeah. <laughs> I can't think of one. Inspiration? She's an inspiration. An inspiration. Kaylee, an inspiration to us all. Yeah, have you ever been badly injured while riding a horse? Nope. 
Well, A, I don't ride horses. Why uh, not? So, you don't like horses and you don't, you don't like, like Doctor Who? And Doctor what does that have to do with anything? No, I've never been hurt in that way. I've never broken a bone. I've never had to be in the hospital for an extended period of time other than visiting a friend. Well, even then, you probably didn't stay that long because your he friend... He was on morphine. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah. boring. Uh, it's like, hey, how you doing? I'm so great. I'm not yeah. It really was... That was my exact experience for it. He was on morphine, the poor guy. Hi, Greg. And, um... <laughs> And uh, he, uh, every time he'd wake up enough to be able to converse with me, he'd be like, hell, and then he'd give himself another shot because he was hurting and right. he'd gone. What happened to him? Uh, it was an elective surgery. Oh. <laughs> well, I don't, I'm, I'm so uncomfortable. I'm talking about other people's surgeries and ailments suddenly. No, that's, that's, right. that's wrong of me. I, no, I wouldn't, I wouldn't go any further. Hey, was, what was if it? he's on your talk show someday? No, exactly. He'll I, be I don't, able I don't, to you're to right. It's not my business. It's, it's, I, and it's not that it's, it's not your okay, business. <laughs> And it's not you that I'm worried about either. It's just I don't know who's beyond this lens. Nobody. Nobody. <laughs> nobody. There's nobody there. Not true. Yeah, no. Uh, so, uh, would you ever get elective surgery? <laughs> um, or if I need something removed that had grown, like, or whatever. I mean, like... <laughs> <laughs> Like if At I what point a, did you think, well, that's too big, it's going to have to come down a little? <laughs> this is never going to work. It scares me. Um, All right, no, then. if I had some sort of uh, non-good growth, I right, would right. Yeah, absolutely. that removed. Yes. You, I, I don't know. I've never and who could blame you? Well, right. You know, it's unsightly and I need to work in front of the camera. Um, uh, I don't know. You it's know. not that kind of show, though. You, no one would see it. You get I had oral surgery. I had some wisdom teeth Oh, out. really? <laughs> And I bounced back as quick as Kaylee. I had a hamburger within 48 hours of having my wisdom teeth out. Wow, you yeah. had your wisdom teeth removed? All of them? Well, I mean, I say. <laughs> this is true, right? You, Mine never came in. You're lucky then. I, I know. You're a freak, but you're lucky. <laughs> and I have an abnormally large growth. <laughs> You know, sometimes it's my only consolation. No, stop, that. stop. The mug you're drinking out is very funny. Oh, it says censored on the bottom. Yeah, I drew a penis there. Uh, oh, stop. I did. Really? Yeah, I was, I was explaining to something to someone, and I said, no, it's a bit like this, and I drew it. Oh, just, uh, you, know, oh, I and you were regressing. And then, rather than get me a new cup, what, the CBS? We just cover it. Yeah, they just cover it up. Well, with the it. budget, you know. Yeah, that's true, and that's an expensive uh, piece of ceramics right piece. there, yeah. It's a And piece. also, it's a phallic symbol, you know, clearly. I know, well, I right. I, do you, uh, you know, do, do you have uh, much uh, in the way of phallic symbols? Where? <laughs> No, lying around your house or stuff. Do you have a big expensive car with a penis-shaped front or no. something? No. I really don't. Uh, oh, what kind of car have you got? What in my life? I have a, a BMW. Oh, German. <laughs> <laughs> That's not why I have it. <laughs> okay. I like the enough. way it drove. No, no. It's, it, it drove on its own. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I wish. Hey, want me to be your car? <laughs> no. Makes me very uncomfortable, actually. No, that's all um, right. uh, I don't right? know what to say, Craig. No, that's all right. I feel you're a bit frosty tonight. No! No, you, uh, you want to talk frost? It's freezing back there. It is. It's it's what happened? I don't know. It's a global colding. No, stop. <laughs> it has never been this cold on your set before. Oh, are you here? Yes. Yeah, I like to keep it very, very, very cold because many times the audiences start to drift. Well, you know what? <laughs> Comedy's not funny in the heat. It's not. Well, nothing's funny in the heat. Because no. all you're like, oh, God. This is true, actually. Yeah, yeah, that's why, you know, comedy sets are always cold. Yep. And drama sets are always warm. I made well, the last bit. Oh, yeah, I was yeah, going to say, yeah. I'm not sure that you need them to be hot to be upset. But, yeah. Although, I'd be angry. Do you keep the... the are you angry now? No. You do have quite a good I'm angry freezing. face there. No, are you angry? Oof. Oh, that's a good angry face. Oof. Mm. Do, you, do you have a quick temper, do you think? I have trouble with patience. Um, mm. uh, my father could be a little impatient. I really got that from him. Mm. Um, I don't like to upset people, though. It upsets me to upset others. And, 
but I am not a patient man. I see. <clears throat> so you have a high-powered BMW. That is not what's going on. That no. is not a. That's not a phallic mobile, is it? I don't know. I, you know. Okay, maybe this will help. When I went to the dealership, I said, "I really like this car. I like the body of the car. I like the way it drives." But I need you to understand, I do not need the best engine you have. I will never go over sixty. 